So Marlene, you're standing in front of one of my favorite pieces in the show, because you know my work is very abstract, my own studio work, very abstract and very non-objective. And someone looking at this piece would think also that it might be completely abstract, but it really is not. It's really dense with story. It's titled, Those Who Came Before Me. Can you tell us a little bit about it? Yes, uh, so this piece developed um, after I, I made the sheet of paper. It's um, a Japanese big sheet of paper with kozo uh, fiber. And I started to print with these uh, stencils on a jelly plate and I was just pressing it in. And I wanted, I, I was sort of thinking about um, the uh, women's rights and uh, you know the, it, I was just thinking about those who came before us who set the tone, who were the first beginning uh, yeah, women who stepped up and stood up for their self, their selves. And so I went back into the um, early part of the Bible and the book and I thought about you know, Queen Esther and Ruth and Miriam and uh, Rebecca. So uh, I decided to uh, put their names and they're stamped in. So they're very subtle and there are, uh, there's a hand stamped in here and I tried to put them around and I painted those white to direct your eyes to where I stamped in the letters of the women um, that came before us. And I used flowers and I have like a pocketbook stamp and I just like some feminine and but, uh, butterflies uh, that are repeated in different sizes. And it just sort of developed and then after that was done, I added uh, color, watercolors um, into areas where I wanted to emphasize the design. So that is the history of it. I wanted to pay homage to uh, the beginning of history because they set the tone and we've been forever continuing that path. For a fight we're still fighting, right? Exactly. 